The home buying power checklist now to make your offer more competitive. Today we're talking about putting more money down as a way in order to make your offer more competitive than a loan requires. So first, on average, normally a loan needs a minimum of 3% down. There are some VA programs out there that allow you to put 0% down, but for us regular buyers that are not veterans, we need to put at least 3% down. Generally, a conventional loan starts at 20% or more. So what does this mean? Say if we had enough in order to put truly 7% down on a property that we were looking to purchase, but we were planning on putting only 3% down. Well, in order to make our offer more competitive, on the offer, we could put a down payment of 7% rather than the 3% that we're intending. Now, what are the ramifications of this? Ultimately, if you could get the loan by putting the 7% down, but you couldn't get the loan at putting 3% down, then you'd have to go ahead and put the 7% down in order to purchase the house. Whether it's right or wrong, because I use myself as the biggest example, my first house I paid three, put 3% 3 down, my second house was 10, and my third house was 20% down. Whether it's right or wrong, the more money that somebody puts down, the better buyer it is perceived on the seller's end, a buyer with less risk. So using the home buying power checklist and putting more money down is a way to make your offer more competitive and ultimately might be the winning reason as to why your offer was accepted over another. I'm Jeff Chubb, my team, the Chubb Homes team, were brokered by eXp Realty. Should you have any questions about the home buying process or how to make your offer more competitive, then we'd love to chat with you. The best number to get us at is 617-480-2600 online at boston2.com or you can reach me by email at jeff at boston2. We look forward to hearing from you and hope you're having a great day.